Hello, my name is Tony Baca. I'm the Senior Vice President of Safety here at Berglund Construction Company. And this week's Safety Toolbox Talk, this third week in the month of March 2022, is on incident and accident reporting. We're on the cusp of hiring back 150 tradesmen. We have a very busy season in both divisions with our building division and our restoration division. So just to refresh your memory, there is a handy dandy text that accompanies this week's safety talk, and it's part of this emergency package. Do you see this yellow sheet of paper? When we have an accident on a job site, I'd like for you to cut this in half because it's actually two yellow cards and send a yellow card with the injured party to the clinic. In the past three years, 50% of our accidents that have gone to the clinics have forgotten to send the yellow card, which gives them authorization to treat and also to call myself and Carol Hall. When we have an incident, an accident, property damage, you are to call me, Tony Baca, and Fred Berglund within 15 minutes. Now inside this package, there are accident reports and there are property damage reports. Very easy to fill out. These are on Procore. They're in your emergency package. They are on the S drive in the safety management folder. They're very easy to find and believe it or not, they're very easy to fill out. But basically when you guys fill this out, you fill out the top line and you fill out the bottom line, but you don't have anything filled out in the middle. This incident and accident report is to be filled out as complete as feasible, not a one minute scribble and send it to me. Give me some information. Let me know if there's any witnesses. Take a hard stab at these instead of sending in what's been coming in, which is embarrassing. So this is the incident accident report. Additionally, property damage. Did we damage someone's vehicle with a boom lift? Did we drop an object off of a scaffold or a suspended board and damage something down below? Once again, call Tony Baca and Fred Berglund within 15 minutes and fill out a property damage report with as much information as feasible. The reason we need as much information as feasible is for our insurance companies, whether it's an accident or property damage. Let's have a safe year. Let's have a safe day. Let's have a safe week. And please make sure you post your OSHA signage and your yellow cards next to it, the 300 log and the clinic. That should be the bare minimum on the wall outside of all of these ethics posters. All right, if you need a new emergency package, let me know. Take care. Thank you.